We're here with Marsha Wagoner. Marsha, you've had such... How are you, Marsha? You've had such phenomenal success in in both uh, non-tournaments and in tournaments. How does your attitude affect your profit at the poker table? Hmm. Um, well, let me tell you, um, I first got the idea about attitude from a lady poker player I like to call my mentor about 30 years ago, and her name was Betty Carey. So I looked at Betty, I watched her carefully, because she was a top player and still is. And I learned about attitude from her. I could see Betty sitting at the table, and she had a demeanor to me of a winning player, just by looking at her. And I decided to adopt that. So I did, and it worked for me. And I don't know if I can completely explain it, um, but it's the way you might sit at the table, and of course you have to have a feeling of being a winner uh, to be able to exude this this demeanor or attitude. I remember Barry, uh, Betty Carey well, and, and uh, well, she did exude confidence. And uh, probably that focuses, don't you think, uh, the opponents, all their energy to you, so they're really aware of you. So you're really uh, sending out signals when, when you play that way. Yes, certainly, Mike. Um, it, it, is, um, it is an air of confidence, self-confidence. Um, and the players you're playing against pick it up, and you do have the ability just through that to intimidate them a little bit. Well, you're one of the best players I've ever seen at doing that, and just <laughs> going through my, my mind right now and thinking how you are at the table, uh, you do that, and you believe that just that image, that very image, really, what does it do to your opponents that makes them give you money? Well, like I said, um, I certainly believe that being able to to exude or give out your your self confidence so strongly to your opponents that they do give you money. They do feel a little intimidated, um, and by that, they're not probably not going to try and bluff you. And if they don't try and bluff you, um, they're giving you money. Um, basically, everything they do when you're playing with them. Is giving you money because you have the power just through that attitude to control them. Well, that's exceptionally good advice. And again, Marsha is telling us that just by having the right attitude, the right image, that right confidence at the table makes your opponents play worse, be intimidated, and give you money. That's wonderful, Marsha. Uh, let me ask you about this. You have such a successful a record in tournaments. Do you have a strategy for how you're going to get the chips in tournament play? 